Hey everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario RPG and you know what? I'm kind of tired. I think I might just take a nap. And uh, what better place to take a nap than good old Rose Town? What's up guys? I know you can handle it. Same for a nap? Sure. Don't worry, it's on the house. I mean, you were so kind to guys. Well, that's mighty kind of you. I guess it's time to wake up. Hey! Wait a minute. Who's this? Ah! <laughs> awesome. So, yeah, if you sleep at uh, the Rose Town Inn, Link shows up. Kind of a nice little Easter egg. The game is full of awesome stuff like that. Anyway, let's move on. You know, there's one thing I want to check before I go. Is it in the Mushroom Kingdom? i suddenly forgotten what it was I wanted to check. I don't think it was actually in the Mushroom Kingdom. Oh yes it was. Now I remember. This guy. Oh wait. 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 Hold on. This is the highest score. Wait hold on. This is the highest score. Alright. Yes. I'm done here. You want this? It's only 500 coins. Well, sure. You need more coin. Oh, what? I forgot it cost a ton of money. So, he's going to give you his, like, a Game Boy if you uh, have 500 coins, which I do not at the moment. Because Mary Moore was freaking expensive. Um, just a, a heads up, I did go ahead and buy the uh, Beta Bring uh, in Mary Moore. Because it's an important item that will be required later on. But now it's time to move on with the story. And that means we need to go to Star Hill. So let's go. Remember last time Fawkfuchsia said, We need to go here and that's where we're going to go. So this is to Marimor. This is the exit to the area. Talk to the flower and the Stargate will open. This is kind of the tutorial for this area. The gimmick here is if you talk to these flowers, the um, gate will open up. Two Star Hill. Alright. So, oh, what does Gina have to say? This is Star Hill. Wishes which were transformed at the Star Road fall from here. But some wishes that haven't been granted yet are falling because Smithy destroyed the Star Road. Confucius mentioned hearing about a star piece on this hill. Let's see if we can find it. Wish I had some cricket jam. Well, that's Confucius's wish right there. Um, the other gimmick is these stars with little faces on them. If you uh, inspect them, they will talk and tell you exactly what um, what wish it is that they represent. Can't wait to start a family. I hope my baby's cute. A lot of them are really funny. I wish I weren't such a crybaby. Like this one. <laughs> this one's private. Who do you think you are spying on other people's wishes? Come on, our quest for the star pieces is more important. Everyone's counting on us. We've got to hurry. Sorry about that. It's just that I'm embarrassed about my wish. Well, you should... No, that's not anything to be embarrassed about. Oh, gosh. I'm trying to avoid the... Uh, um, bandit enemies, but I might fight one of these mukumukus. Or are they just regular? No, they're mukumukus. Um, Suikoden fans will appreciate that. But, uh, they're not too bad. And now we get to see Princess uh, attack. Slap the heck out of that guy. Now I'm actually going to do something a little... I'm going to use a Yoshi cookie, so we get to see what this does. So basically, it summons Yoshi. Yoshi eats an enemy and transforms it into an item. So we now have a Muku cookie, which we can use later on. And we also got a maple syrup. Did I check that one? Yeah, I did. Oops, sorry. So, in order to open the gate, you have to find every single one of these flowers in, in an area. So, it's not just one and, and done. Like, 
the first screen. If I could just get that melody, oh Todovsky, I'm sure you'll find it somehow. Um, I want to be the best treasure hunter in the world. Well, good luck with that. Please let Mallow find his way. What? Why, this wish is... It's from my mom and dad. They're wishing for me to come home. Everybody's sad. Oh, oh my. This isn't the time to be crying. They're waiting for me to come home. Come on, Mario. We've got a busy schedule to keep. I'll make you eat dust if you don't hurry. That's what you think, little puffball thing. I just... I already read that one. And here's another one. I want to be a vault class baker. Well, that's obviously Torte from Mary Moore. The hunger. Oh, for some food. That one makes me feel bad. Because obviously it's... I don't know. It's someone that's very hungry. And I hope they get some food soon. Whoever it is. Lots of flowers and uh, yeah, yeah, you go away. Don't want to fight you. Really, just do not. I want to be a great plumber like my brother Mario. It's Luigi's wish. I wish I could run faster. Those parentheses make me think it's it's Yoshi. I hope I become famous. Well, that door. Oh, oh, look! There it is. There's the star piece. Hooray! Star piece number four. Give me that star piece. Oh. Hooray! Purple star. Get. And yes, that is star piece number four. We're more than halfway to our goal. You've come a long way, but your journey's not over yet. There are three more star pieces. Woohoo! There's one thing I want to check. I need to figure out how this works. Because I want those coins. There's stuff I want to buy. And I can't buy it because I don't have enough money. And we're done here. And we'll exit out. Um, so yeah, Star Hill is a pretty short area. Um, nice little break almost. But uh, we're not quite done with this episode. We're going to go visit Seaside Town. And I, I like that. It's an anchor with a little fish on it. <laughs> okay, now there's something I want to check. Okay, good. 227 coins. Alright. Hey, guy. What are you doing on the counter? This is the inn. You may stay for free. Um, thanks? Okay. What? That guy. You get back here. Okay, so he doesn't... Okay, good. I thought he might steal something, but he doesn't. Actually. I'm going to go back and save. Now, uh, as you can see, we got the four stars on our save file. There is nothing of interest here. Don't bother looking inside. You may not enter here. This is a restricted area. Well, all right. I'm just a customer. Don't tell me you want supplies. I know. So, don't pick up. I, you know, most of this stuff I would say is not worth it. <laughs> Muku cookies are, are worth 69 coins. Um, 
the bombs are pretty good, but uh, very pricey, as you can see. Bad mushrooms, as you might guess, not something you want to get. In the middle of the ocean is a pirate ship. You'll find a... I mean, there's a... A pirate lives there. His name is Jonathan Jones. He isn't very nice. A star has fallen into the sea. The pirate probably... I mean, that man, uh, Jonathan Jones, probably has it. He's nasty. This place is just bizarre. Why are you on top of that shelf, sir? What? You're collecting stars, right? Only three more to go. How the heck do you know that? Why do you know this? S talk, you weird blue-looking shopkeeper guy. If you want to enter the ocean, jump into the whirlpools. You will find the village elder in his house. He is the most respected person here. These guys are just bizarre. They keep spinning and spinning. Just keep spinning, spinning, spin. Okay, enough, enough of that. Finally, it took you long enough. I am the elder of this village. I got to my exalted station in life by pleasing my superiors, which is something I do well. Ho ho ho, that's what she said. A star has fallen into the ocean. I need it for a certain purpose. You must find it for me. I ain't gonna do nothing, bruh. Hello there. You're Maria, right? Do you remember me? We met at Tadpole Pond when I was still a tadpole. I've graduated from Frog Fuchsia's school, and now I'm searching for the meaning of life. It's been so quiet around here, it's almost eerie. Is something going on? It probably doesn't concern me, but if you have any frog coins, I've got some neat items to sell. And he sure does have some neat items to sell, but they're very expensive. The experience booster, which as you can see doubles experience when equipped, which is fantastic. Coin trick doubles the coins you win in battle, which is absolutely fantastic. And the Scrooge Ring cuts FP use in half during battle, which is amazing. I want all three of these eventually, but I don't have enough for the, the two that I want most. The experience booster, I would probably say for last, even though it's the cheapest, I, I could technically get it right now. The coin trick is more important. I would recommend going for the coin trick first. And then um, the Scrooge Ring would definitely be, uh, you know, these two are really interchangeable. You could get, but if you want more experience, if you want to level up faster, that's also a good idea. The experience booster would be a good choice as well. But I'm going to wait till I get that coin trick. Um, okay, so that's pretty much all we can do right now. Um, there's nothing over here. Well, that was a weird trip, but I don't I don't even know. I don't even know what to say about this place. It's weird. Um, also, be aware that there's no um, hidden chests here, so you don't need to worry about that. But uh, that'll do it for this episode of Let's Play Super Mario RPG, and I will see you for the next one.